Let's go over what you've learned in Google Analytics for Beginners. Mm -hmm. We discussed how digital analytics can help your business, showed you how Google Analytics works, and walked you through how to create an account, install the tracking code, and set up different views with filters for testing. Yep. You should also feel pretty comfortable with how to navigate around analytics, mm -hmm. how to read through overviews and full reports, and how to set up dashboards and shortcuts to quickly find the data you need. We hope that you also understand how to perform basic analysis in the audience, acquisition, and behavior reports. Finally, we introduced you to campaign tracking and how to set up goals to measure conversions. We also showed you how to link your analytics and AdWords accounts to track and optimize AdWords campaigns. But before we go, let's look at a few additional ways to improve your business using Google Analytics data. Great idea, Justin. If you want to see the top performing pages for new users, under Behavior, go to Site Content and click on the All Pages report. Then, add a secondary dimension of user type so you can see which of your top pages are being visited by new users. This can help inform your site content and marketing campaign strategy to acquire even more users. If you want to identify ineffective landing pages, Go to the Behavior Reports under Site Content and open the Landing Pages report. Sort by bounce rate to see which pages are responsible for people leaving without engaging with your site. If you're running campaigns and want to correlate these landing pages with your marketing efforts, add a secondary dimension of campaign or source medium. Then you can examine which campaigns and landing pages are turning away users and make corrections. Also, it's important to understand how users on different devices respond to your digital marketing campaigns. To view user campaign data across devices, go into the Acquisition Reports and choose Campaigns, and then All Campaigns. Then add a secondary dimension of Device Category to the report. Now it's easy to see what happens to users on different devices as they respond to your digital marketing campaigns. There's also the potential to optimize your digital campaigns using geographical data and goals. Navigate to the Location Report in the Geo section of Google Analytics. Then, under the Conversions pull-down menu to the right, select a goal that you're interested in and sort by Goal Conversion Rate. This will help you see which cities or countries had the highest conversions and help you target those locations accordingly. You should now know how to use Google Analytics to better understand your audience, improve the efficiency of your digital marketing, and increase website conversions. That's right. Don't forget to set up your analytics account with multiple views for testing and add filters to create reliable, accurate data. Also, set up goals to track your website conversions and make sure you've tagged your marketing campaigns correctly for tracking. Thank you for participating in Google Analytics for Beginners. And don't forget to take the final assessment to receive your certificate. And please, take our brief end of course survey. We obviously love data. And use your feedback to improve our future Analytics Academy courses. Happy, Happy analyzing. analyzing.